Hey there, so in this tutorial video, I want to show you how you can build a beautiful blog like this with the website builder of Wix. We will go through this step by step and I will show you how you can edit your homepage, put in your tutorials and how to write blog posts and publish them in the end. One last thing before we start, really important, you will find the link to Wix down in the description of this video. And if you click on this, you will land on this page. And if you sign up here with your email, you can start your free trial. So it's completely free to test it out. And at the same time, this link is a partner link. So you're helping me and my channel to grow a little bit. So thank you a lot if you're using my link. Um, yeah, and without further ado, let's start. So just click on the link type in your email address and once you've done that you will land on this screen and this is the new AI of Wix and you can start chatting with it and describing what kind of blog you want to publish and then it will add all the features and it will also add some text to it already but this will take some time like three to five minutes so I don't want to bore you with that right now and I will skip this step but please go ahead feel free to chat with the AI and have the AI help you with that. So here it's asking you what type of website do you want to build I will say I want to build a blog and go ahead with that and click continue. And now Wix is setting up our site and we will land in the dashboard of Wix. This is the back end of Wix. Here you will have your analytics, your marketing and your inbox if someone writes you. So this is basically the admin area. People coming to your blog won't see this. This is just for you to manage your site. And Wix will give you a short to-do list how to set up your blog. And we will start with the first step actually to design our site because we do have to choose a template now. And in this step, you can either have the AI generate a template for you, but the website is kind of basic. I do like the pro templates here. They are also for free, but they look more professional. I feel like the AI is not there yet. So I will go ahead and pick a template. And here, of course, you have your blog templates for a personal blog, for food and travel blog, for a new business, arts, fashion, beauty and sports. And you can choose from it. So you can just go ahead, click on view and have a look at the blog. This is the homepage and here are the blog posts and you can click on it and get a feeling for this if you like the template. And if you do like it, you can just click on edit the site. But the thing I want to do now I don't want to choose a block template because you can add a block to all templates here on the block templates it's just pre-installed on the template but you can also go ahead and choose a different template for example if you go here to a portfolio website I like this template a lot so I can just choose it and click edit and now the editor of Wix will load this is the editor of Wix so we can zoom in and here you can simply go in and edit everything so we can just go in and click edit text and say okay I'm Julian Weber. So this is the same as you would do in PowerPoint or Word. You can just edit the text, make it bold, change the color, make the font size, change the font and so on. And the good part about Wix is that it is a drag and drop editor. So you can really drag the text around and put it wherever you like. And of course, this is how you change the text, but you can change images. So we can go here and change the background image. And you can either use the stock photos of Wix or from Unsplash or you upload your own media. So for example, I have uploaded my own image here. Then I can click on change background and Wix will put in my image. So this top part is already customized to my page. So it feels like my homepage. I just have to edit this part here, change text, Julian weber.com for example and now you would go ahead and change the other sections of the site so here is another about me section and you can just go in change the headline change the paragraph link the button then you would go to the next section change the video and here you can upload some more photos of you for example and of course you can always add new sections so you can click on add section and then Wix will bring up this menu here and here you can add a couple of more sections so an about section a team section or a contact section if people from your website should contact you and you can also add more elements to the section so if you have a section here then you can add text images buttons stripes boxes galleries and so on and if you want to add a new site you can simply go here and here you see our home page and you can just click on add menu and you can add a new site for example a contact page and then Wix will bring up some templates and you can simply click add page and then Wix will add the contact page to your site this is basically 
basically the main functionality of how to make a website with Wix. I have a lot of tutorials on this topic on my channel. If you like, please go ahead and after this video, watch those videos. It will definitely help you to understand how to build multiple sites with Wix. But in this tutorial, we actually want to see how to manage our blog with Wix. So I keep the first part on the website really short. And let's jump to the second part, how to add our blog to our Wix site. And we can do this by going to the app market of Wix because Wix builds its own apps. So we can just go here and type in blog and then we will see, okay, here's the Wix blog app. And then we can go ahead and install this. And this is what I meant with, you can add the blog to any page, to your online store, to your website from Wix. This is just an app like you would add on your phone, just add it to your website. And then the whole functionality of the blog will be added to your site. So we can click on open. And now Wix is adding the blog here and you see the menu item just appeared here and we will have the blog here. And this is the blog page now. Here we see some dummy posts. So now you can blog from everywhere, grow your blog community. So it always gives you three dummy posts. And of course we want to add now our own blog. But just to make sure that you've got the step. So we just added the app, my blog to the website. And now you can see here in my business, you see Wix blog. And from here you can create create the post, manage the post and so on. And we have the menu item here block and you can always navigate to it by just going from the homepage to the block. And now you can just click on it and click on manage post. And this will bring us back to the dashboard of Wix. And here is where we can edit our blog post. And let's start by creating our own new blog post. And this is the editor where we upload our content for the blog. So we can add a title and we can add here the content of the blog. But before we start, I want to show you the AI tools because we can now have the AI write a blog post for us. And this is pretty cool because then you don't have to start with a blank canvas and you don't have to start from scratch. And for example, for me, who's not really good at writing, this is a big plus because then I have something to work with. So I click on blog post and then I can just type in my title. Topic. So I just said I have a YouTube tutorial on how to build your own website with Wix and I want a blog post for this. Then I click next and now it's asking me how many words I want. So I keep it at 500 to 1000. What should be the tone of voice, professional, casual, for example, I like casual. And how many images do you want? Let's choose one and see how good the AI creates images for us. And here you can also add more preferences. So post type, standard, listicle, this is more like a how to and point of view, first person. So I describe how I write blog posts. So this is really advanced already. So you can give a lot of information to the AI and uh, yeah, even the reader audience and also put in some keywords. So Wix website would be the keyword. And let's see how good the AI will create the blog post for us. So I can now choose my title. For example, I like this one, building my own website with Wix, a beginner's guide to creating an online presence and then create the post. And now the post is created. This didn't take long. It was under a minute. And now we have our headline here. We have our first paragraph, getting started, select the right template. Then we have our image. Okay, you can tell this is an AI image, but well, okay, we can change that, of course. And now we can go in and make it our own. For example, getting started, let's put a one before that. And then the second step would be select the right template. And yeah, we can also just go in and add more stuff. So we can just click on the plus us and we can add another image. We can have the AI generate an image for us. Or for example, we can place a video here, which is pretty cool. So I can just go ahead and place a YouTube link here. And then it will put in my YouTube tutorial on how to build a website with Wix. So I do think this is pretty cool. I don't like this image too much. So I can just delete it. And then I can go ahead and write some more text. And you can, of course, manage the text here. You can make it bold and you can link it. So this is very important. If you, for example, an affiliate like me, you can link your affiliate links here. So you can enter the link and then you have some options on how the link should behave and then click save. And if you want to have it more visual, you can of course add a button. So you can just click a button here and then go here and say link to Wix. And then you can add the link and click save. And then when someone is on your blog and clicks on this button, it will bring them to 
Wix. And now you would go ahead and add your content. And what I think is pretty cool because you don't have just the basic elements like videos, buttons and galleries. You can also put in a table and a poll, for example, so you can ask the reader something and you can have an expendable list. And you can, of course, add your own HTML code, which is pretty cool because then you can pretty much include everything there from the web. And you can also monetize with AdSense from Google. So you can put in a banner here and which will be used by Google to place some ads and this will play into your AdSense account. So you will get actually some money from writing the blog post, which is pretty cool. So this is how you add content to your blog. But we also have some other items here, the settings, because you do have a featured image, which is really important because if someone shares your blog, this feature image will be displayed on, for example, WhatsApp or Facebook or LinkedIn. So choose a really attention grabbing image here. You can have your published date who wrote the blog so you can add more writers if you have like some freelancers for example and you can write an excerpt so which is a short description but most important you have your SEO here and the SEO is for yeah for Google that it will find your site so for example if someone goes to Google how to create a blog with Wix then this is the meta title and this is the description and of course we do have to put it in so we go to our blog here and we put in the title and there should be something like Wix website or Wix blog block inside the title as the keyword and we have our meta description and we should also place some keywords in there and this is the URL and this should be short so I would go with Wix website just to keep it short and simple and one more thing you can go back to the settings and you can also put your blog into a category or put in a tag a category is something to organize the whole blog for example if I have tutorials on website building or online shop tutorials then I would divide them into categories and tags would be something like like build a website with Wix, with Squarespace, with WordPress or so on. So different brands, for example. And you can just put in the text describing the blog post better. And which is also pretty cool, you can translate your blog in different languages and you can monetize it. So you can ask the person coming to your blog for signing up for a subscription and they can pay you some money for getting access to your blog articles. But I'm based on affiliate money, so I will just place in my affiliate links and then I can click save or publish and then the blog post will be live directly or I can schedule the post. So I can go in here and say, okay, please post this blog post on Friday at noon and then just click schedule. And this will bring me to this part here. And here I can see all my posts. So this one is scheduled, none is published. And if I haven't set up anything, it will be in draft. You can also manage your comments here. So if someone comment on your blog, this will be shown here. You also have your categories here and your tags. So go ahead and add those to your blog and you can manage your writers. If you have a freelancer, you can add them here. And of course, the monetization, you can have subscription plans, you can monetize with AdSense and you can also ask for a donation through a form. So this is pretty, pretty cool. I do like it a lot from Wix that they have all these options. I also set up my own website with Wix and I'm pretty happy with my blog. And as you can see, it also gets a lot of views. So a lot of people out there say you do have to have a WordPress blog to get some views, but that's not not simply not true. I get a lot of views on my articles here. So and if you want to try it out, as said, you will find the link to Wix under this video. It's the first one, just click on it. And then you can sign up for free and start building a website and then just add the blog to it and then write your first blog article. I wish you all the best with this. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and we see us in the next video. Goodbye.